onto the snow. Accessing technology remains a significant challenge for individuals from lower socio-economic backgrounds in South Africa. The high cost of technology creates a digital divide between those with and without internet access. According to data from Statistics South Africa, only 10.4% of households have access to the internet at home through fibre or ADSL. The primary barrier to access is the expensive equipment along with high monthly cost. Moreover, South Africa falls short of the affordability threshold set by the UN Broadband Commission as one gigabyte of data consumes more than 2% of the average monthly income for many citizens. Chief Operating Officer at ours, Sanali Siwa Njobe, shares her perspective on the matter. Hi, so the World Bank says that over half of Southern Africa's population lives in rural areas. However, these communities are largely unconnected. This is due to the high cost of fiber deployment and the building of cellular masks relative to the population densities of these communities. For those within range of mobile networks, the cost of data then becomes the barrier. Um, sitting at 85 Rand per gigabyte in South Africa and $17 per gigabyte in Namibia. This creates a skills gap in terms of digital literacy, which essentially affects um, employment, future employment opportunities for young people. A solution would be to integrate technological tools in education from a young age and also ecosystem players coming together uh, to solve this problem together. So governments, NGOs and corporates working together to solve these issues and also infrastructure sharing to achieve economies of scale. Looking to the future, satellites do propose as a solution. However, they would need to increase, uh, decrease their pricing to make it more affordable and also um, looking at increasing the speed of connectivity.